Hello everybody, it's Nim and welcome back to my channel. Today we are back with Zootosh after a week of not uploading. We are back this week. We are gonna take it slow though, so two videos a week, perhaps one. Just building it up very slowly. Don't worry about me though. So today we are touring a zoo and it's called Asian Canyon Zoo. And you can already see by the cinematics why it's called that. It looks freaking amazing. It is made by Adam Kiki on the Steam Gallery. It has a very short description. It just said, I spent a week to make it. I hope you like it. Well, we're gonna find out. I mean, just looking at the cinematics and looking at the zoo, it looks amazing. It is not incredibly large, but it feels that way. I hope you like it, guys. Um, make sure that if you do, you like, comment and subscribe. You can also hit the bell icon if you want, so you get notified when my next video comes out. Now, with no further ado, let's get into the video. Also, like before I forget, please ignore the audio in the actual zoo tours. Um, something went wrong with my mic. I don't know what, but I can't fix it. So uh, I'm sorry, but I hope you have enjoyed anyways. Hello guys and welcome back to the Canyon Zoo. We're gonna go in and like I said in the intro, uh, my neighbors are at the moment moving, so I'm sorry for any uh, loud noises, it's their fault. This looks fabulous. Just as foliage here. Wow. I like it. The rock work as well looks really cool. And you can immediately see why it's called the Canyon Zoo. I mean, look at it. It's so pretty. I can hardly believe it. Here again with the, the wheel of water just coming out slightly. This is a small fountain they used. I like it. I like it very much. Very nice. Oh, look at this. It's just flowing off in here. You can hear it as well. I hope you guys can hear it. I turned the sound of this uh, sound a little bit more. So you can actually hear it. So here's the actual entrance. Wow. Look at that. That's amazing. It's the toilets and the ticket you center. Nice. Okay, usually I always go left, but I, I kind of want to go straight. I want to... Wow, you look at that. This is pretty. Really nice work or really nice foliage. I mean, wow. All these little streams, they are exactly at the right place where we'd see it naturally. You now there's a waterfall, then you have like a little acceleration between the rocks and you actually see the water going down into the, the other waterfall. Really natural, really well done. Also the bins colored like that, I like it. I feel like this zoo is going to be really pretty at night as well. <gasps> Look, there's more! Oh, also flamingo habitat! Wow! Oh, baby one! Right, it was just, uh, I love to, that you've closed it off using these logs. That's really clever. I really like that. Same on the other side, just close it off as the water can still naturally flow through it. I like it. It's a foraging pond and the water is really natural. I love it. I like it. So here is the staff facilities, the keeper hut. Wow. These colors are amazing. Obviously the entrance. I love the variation in the path, the natural path, and then the stone leading up to the stairs. I like it. Oh, I love the elephant uses as well, the elephant grass uses. And it really feels like you're inside a canyon. Oh, uh, I do this as well. See, these are like trees. They're sunken in completely. I do this all the time. Also, there are animals escaping. Oh no, Japanese macaque. Well, I don't really care. We'll see them later. They're all looking at something. I don't know what they're looking at. What are you looking at? Habitat 7. Well, apparently um, there is something going on here because all these people are looking at it. We're just gonna continue. Yeah. Oh, I guess an animal escapes. <laughs> I love this. You know, these plants. They're still a bit. Um, I don't want to say empty, but what I usually do is press Ctrl X and then X again. You can kind of make them feel a little bit fuller. See the see the difference between that, between this one and this one. 
This is a single plan, there's a multiple plans. Obviously, if you don't really have a good PC, um, I wouldn't advise doing this because it takes up quite a bit of the actual space. Alright. So, oh, look at the panda bear. Well, everyone's running away, so we're gonna go th uh, towards it. Oh, balloons. I'm guessing this might be the Japanese macaque outside. Oh, I love this with the bamboo in between. Really clever. I like this as well, like you covered stuff past, and then they're in between the rocks. Nice! Oh wow. Wow, we can even walk on top of it. Nice. Red panda. It's all red panda. Oh, oh look, there they are. I used to be, as a kid, I used to be a member of the Rangers Club, and that would uh, evolve around Huppy, and Huppy was a red panda, and I had a red panda keychain. Uh, oh, it's climbing down! That's so cute. I really enjoy this. Oh, it's climbing up! Oh, it's going to climb over! Oh, it's just... Oh, there are so many of them. And they have like, this food thing to make sure they go up, and then it's going down again. That's a baby one. Aww. Wow. I'll screenshot that. Oh, this is so cute. You're gonna do it as well, little one? Yes, you are. Oh. Oh, the noises they make. Amazing. Wow. Let's just go through here. Ah! Oh, getting food. It's coming down. Is it gonna eat? It's or spewing. I don't know. It's spewing. Okay. Ooh, I love these rocks. You don't, I don't see these rocks used a lot, but I really like them. Wow, it's, you've painted it green. I like it. I really like it. I also like this shot. Nice. Oh, I love, oh, I love red pandas. Look at them eating. So cute. And it's playing with the box. Nice. I, also, with the ivy, like going over here, really nice, really natural. Now you have some toilets and the shop. Nice. Mm -hmm. Left or straight? Let's go straight ahead. I mean, I can do everything different already. I like this. I really like this. That's the stuff area. What's in here? What is this? It's nothing. Okay. It looks fantastic with the bell in there as well. On the panda, it looks really great. So, um, let's follow this path. I feel like I'm gonna get so lost. I'm guessing it will, uh, it will go around there again. I'm not sure. Oh no, litter. That's a shame. Ooh. Ooh, we could go up or down. Okay, so if we've been there, oh, I didn't see that. That's nice. Let's. Get it. There is so much to see here. Let's go this way. This is a Japanese macaque and it needs some berry shelving. I love, oh, I love the view here. I mean, it's like this really close up and then you have this open area back there. I like it. So I'm using these poles, the glass, nice. Ah, oh, the sleepy quarters. I did this in the... My red tail zoo as well, that will be coming out on Friday. But I did this exact thing. This looking a little bit sad. Are you happy? Yes, you are. You're happy monkey. Keeper's hut, really lovely keeper's hut. Nice entrance here, so nice little water flow bits. I like it. So I feel like we're going into a different area, but I'm, I kind of want to see the Japanese macaque hands out. I love the waterfall. I love it. I'm a big fan of waterfalls. Like I use waterfalls in all my suits. Waterfalls is what makes me happy. So, also these climbing areas with the snow, which is very natural because the Japanese macaque they actually live in snow next to the uh, hot water sources in Japan. I really like it. Like you could use some steam to indicate that this was warm water because they really like that. They like hot tops as well. But I'm really happy with how this looks. It looks nice. 
And at the same time, I wish there was a little bit uh, more in here. Like you did use the effects here, that's pretty nice. Like the downside, it looks, I don't want to say it looks bland, but it's kind of empty. I would have expected more because all the surroundings look so alive and, you know, much. But oh well. Oh, I like this as well. The pedophiles, a little bit of a shop area with all the different shops and statues of pedophiles. Really like it. And the fountains, ATMs, like really important. And here you can look down and like it. Oh, this little this lights as well. Nice. I'm actually doing the course in uh, Japanese. I know that this is Chinese, but they use like well, they don't, they don't use the same signs. I mean, sometimes they do, but yeah. I don't know where I'm always going with this. Ah, oh, more shops. Nice. We're going down, down, down. Let's go here. So this is the way to the other side of the Japanese macaque. See, I love this. This here with the steam, it indicates it's warm. If you would have done that here as well, it would mean that you have like this uh, hot warm source. Hot, hot water source. Wow. But I love this with the bamboo. I really like that. It looks really nice. Oh, Japanese macaque. Yes, and that's the red panda. So let's... Oh, I didn't even see the outside of this. Wow, it reminds me a little bit of a, of a temple. I like it. Again, here with all the different water features. I love it. It goes all the way from up there. It flows all the way down the zoo. I really enjoy that. So we came from there as well. Oh. Uh, let's go straight ahead. The Crawler Cave. That sounds a little bit creepy. Ooh, it does really feel like a cave. Oh, it's exhibits! So the guano. Oh, I can see his tail. Spotted you. So blue. I'm gonna pop all the balloons. Wait, there. <laughs> um, nothing in here. Or it's not powered. It's empty. Okay, well, yeah, that explains it. Then here we have the Gila monster that's there. And then we have something that's empty. I like that. I like this little cave. I really love the way it's like carved into the stone. I enjoy that. I don't want to go up because I feel like this would be the other way around and I want to see that. Yeah, that would be the other way around. So then we would have a little food course. Oh, the music. Oh, I like that. This looks really nice. Again, with the foliage and the rock work. Wow. Could have used some foliage on this side as well, but okay. I love the use of these trees, by the way. Like, those are in-game trees, right? Yeah. I've never actually seen people use them a lot, and I really like them. Oh, okay, I notice it's stuff, so you're just gonna have a look. Water supplies. Oh, a snap lunch. Lovely. That's really neatly done. Really nice. Toilets. Ah, now we're going over the bridge. I love this. This looks really cool. I mean, you can you can look down here. You can see the water, and we're really high up. I enjoy that. And here again, you can see all the guests in the water. Nice. Let's just look at it like this. Wow! Look at those roofs. Look at it. That's so cool. That's really nice. That's really well done. Okay, if I screenshot it like this, that looks nice. It's this as well, like those temple pieces. I like it. It looks really neat. Oh, this view. Like, a tiger. I can hear it. <gasps> there it is. Wow. Quite a lot of tigers in here, aren't they? Um, we're just gonna jump in. I love tigers. Wow. 
so like magnificent animals. I I love this fence. Is that a custom fence? It is. Very nice. Oh, I love the little like sleeping area here in the little temple. I also like the fact that you didn't use a barrier here because like they wouldn't be able to jump jump down from here. Like in real life they probably tried, but also here the water. Cool. All the bamboo, this looks really nice. And here the tree going through the fence into the flowers. Oh, I do that as well. <laughs> I can see that, uh, you know, we think like, again with the water. Yes. Oh, there's a cup sleeping. Oh, there are a lot of tigers in here. Wow. But the only viewing point you have is from up here. Oh, that's a, that's a bit of a shame, like you... I probably would have liked to see another viewing point somewhere on eye level, but this it looks really nice. Also very nice down with the donation pin. Oh, I can hear this plaza. That looks really nice. The Peace Tower. Is there anything in the Peace Tower? No. Oh well. Those look like toilets. Oh yeah, toilets. And here we have a viewing point. Ooh, we're really high up. I like it. I like that all the paths as well, like they fall together again, so they are like they separate and then they join again. I like this. It looks really nice. Also with all the statues that you used, it looks really like an Asian zoo. Oh, look. I love your eye to detail. Stop, sentence the tiger. A shop. Oh, something escaped. Ah, oh, this is the path where I originally went white. Okay, so here we have another <gasps> red panda. Oh, they have a baby. Oh, they're going swimming. Sweet. That's really nice. The waterfall, that looks really good. Really natural, nice. Let's just... Ooh, I love this. I can, I can see this is custom. And I like it. Let's uh, move up here and see what else they have to there. Oh, that is snowy. And it's got other oh, more pandas up here. Aww, that's a little baby. Oh, look at how cute it is. It's so cute, I want to pet you. Oh, it made noise. Oh, this is a lovely view. I quite like it. Lovely habitat. I like that it's built up with all the different levels. Wait, they have a cave. They have a cave behind here where they can sleep. Oh. I like the use of the hay and that we use together. They can sleep behind the waterfall so they have privacy. Nice. I don't understand why not more people are standing here. <laughs> this is really nice. Like I said with the levels, you did forget to turn on your education board. There you go. I like it. Oh, this one's also off. Oh. Star facilities. I love this foliage work. I like it. I like it a lot. It's a and then you have this natural path leading down. Uh, I do wish you put some more, like the foliage you have here, this looks really nice, but you could, you could have put it down there, maybe some rocks to break the wall. Yeah, kind of like you did here. Let's see. Oh, I thought there was an animal in there. <laughs> Ooh, a hook. Okay, well, um, since that's all stuff. Yeah. I like this little homemade pathway. Very nice. Very nice indeed. 
I feel like that's an exit. I want to go here. This will probably lead us to the main path. What the heck was that voice? What just... Wow. It's so big. <laughs> yeah, so this will lead us back to the main path. So let's move up here. Oh, oh, this is very cute. I like this very much. I really like this. This looks really neat. Zoos usually have this, like this little circle for kids to run around in and see some oops, see some stuff. I like it. So let's go back. Here. I feel like we're exiting the zoo right now, I don't know. Yeah, we're exiting. Oh, I love this work here. I really like this. Also here with a... It's coming... It's even coming out here. Wow. That's really clever. I really enjoy this. I really like this. Wow. Well, that was the entire zoo. So let's uh, give ourselves an overview look. It's not the largest zoo. Like when I opened it, I was like, oh, well, you know, the entire map is very big and you only use like a very small portion of the entire map. But what you did with it is really good. It really feels like a, like a big zoo, even though it's not. And I feel like that's probably because it's built out of so many levels. You start real low and then you move up the canyon, you go around it and then here again to the levels and you go back. I wait, did I see this? Oh wait, this is staff only, right? No, it's not. Oh, I didn't even see this. You can look at down at the pandas from up here. Wow. Okay, so I didn't even see that. That's really nice. I'm wondering if I've seen everything. Okay, if you're watching, um, I'm sorry if I missed anything. I really like it. Okay, so now let's um, look at it in nighttime. I expect it to be very nice lit up. Yes, yeah, yeah, that's what I expected. With all the torches here. And then the lights there. Ah, oh, this is lovely. This is really well done. Could have used some lights up there. But wow. I love it. This looks really, really nice. Just, whoa, very bright. Okay, well, yes, like you know the drill for now. If you want your zoo to be toured, um, make sure you join the Discord where you can share the links to your Steam creation. And then we can uh, tour that as well. We do a zoo tour every week. For now, I'm just scattering them to Steam Gallery. So if you see anyone, anything that you like on the Steam Gallery, uh, feel free to share that as well. That's completely fine with me. Also, if you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And you can also hit that bell icon here to be so you can know about when my next video goes live. My next video will be live on Friday. We are skipping Wednesday videos for now. Um, you know, like no particular reason, I'm just, I don't know, that's going to that great. So we are skipping Wednesday videos for now and we are focusing on the Monday and Friday videos. So guys, again, thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you all on Friday. Bye guys.